Well, the folks in Port Alberni and the valley itself is putting its best foot forward right now as production crews from the World Fishing Network are touring the town for a special broadcast that will market the Alberni Valley to the fishing world. The network is airing a half-hour special on the Alberni Valley, and the focus will be on the great fishing there. It's all part of the prize that Port Alberni won with the title of Ultimate Fishing Town Canada for 2010. A News mid Allen Bureau Chief Jonathan Bartlett has the story. Not that Cathedral Grove really needs exposure. McMillan Provincial Park already gets hundreds of thousands of visitors. The massive Douglas fir trees are a big draw for tourists. Absolutely incredible. I don't think I've ever been so fascinated by trees. A TV crew from the World Fishing Network is here to capture Cathedral Grove and other attractions around Port Alberni. The half-hour promotional video to be aired later in the year is part of a prize awarded to the ultimate fishing town last fall. In addition to the amazing salmon fishing that the town has, they also obviously have beautiful wildlife and trees and all of that. So we want to make sure that we show the viewers who've never been to the area what it's all about. What we're doing is basically a promotional tourism show for Port Alberni. And what better place to, to come than Cathedral Grove to really show off some of the unique things that Port Alberni has to offer. The WFN crew will be hosted here all week. They'll be shown around to all the best that Port Alberni has to offer, including, of course, the fishing. The contest, based on online votes, also dished out a $25,000 prize to the Ultimate Fishing Town. Winning the contest, uh, Ultimate Fishing Town designation for Port Alberni, first of all, made the town proud. I think that's one of the most important things. And then, of course, the $25,000 prize, which we've leveraged and leveraged, and we continue to leverage to, to put towards salmon enhancement projects and uh, better promotion. Even without the promotional video, the contest has given Port Alberni international exposure The money just can't buy. Definitely need the exposure. We're a town in revitalization right now, and any kind of good exposure is good for business. The community is really pulled together, and we're, we've got a committee formed with the Ultimate Fishing Town group. It's made up of a diverse group uh, from different organizations in town. We're looking at beautifying uh, Port Alberni in some sort of an ultimate fishing town theme and carrying on from there. This year, the World Fishing Network awarded another community ultimate fishing town status. This time, Chaplow, Ontario won. But for people who fish here, Port Alberni will always be the ultimate. We caught, we got nine, which is good. Yeah. We're happy. There's lots of fish out, a lot of boats though. It's pretty good right now. I mean, we... Uh, we definitely had a couple of bites, you know, double headers, and so that was kind of fun.